Apple wants their toys back. The developer transition kit, a Mac mini body housing an iPad Pro A12Z SoC with 16 gigabytes of memory and 500 gigabytes of storage that Apple distributed to developers ahead of Apple Silicon's public launch for $500 a piece has reached the end of its life and is being recalled by Apple. This seems to have displeased many developers as they were originally to have these for a year of development and now after seven months, several of which were apparently so buggy as to be unusable, Apple is asking for them back and was offering a $200 credit towards an Apple Silicon Mac on the return. This has now been increased to $500 which seems to have helped but of course many developers have already invested in an M1 device though the credit as far as I'm aware can be spent on anything at Apple. So its software updates have now been cut off but developers who did update to the Mac OS 11.3 beta found some of the connectivity disabled on the devices too. Now I'm typically on Apple's side in most cases but here there seems to have been a few let's say communications issues assuming what we've heard to be accurate and when the native Apple Silicon apps are so few and far between it might pay them well to offer a few more socially distanced e-hugs to those who have the power to fix it. Just saying. I'm Ike Dave and I simplify Apple so everything just works for you. And if you want the latest Apple news, leaks and rumours every weekday at 12 UTC, like this video, subscribe to the channel and ring the notification bell so that you don't miss a thing and post up hashtag notification squad down in the comments so that I can give you a shout out at the end of the next video.